Hey everyone, uh, today we're going to show you how to set up uh, NDI with Streamlabs OBS and the Go XLR. So um, the main setup for a Go XLR, normally for a two PC setup, is you would have a 3.5mm uh, aux cable out of the line out of the Go XLR into your streaming PC uh, and then on the streaming PC on the headphone or line out uh, coming back to the Go XLR. Um, so in this case, uh, we can actually remove one of those cables because we're going to use NDI to do that. So the first thing to do in order to set up NDI with Streamlabs is uh, go to the NewTek website, uh, click on NDI, and then go to uh, download, and you're going to download the NDI tools. Once you download and install the tools, the application that you're going to want to launch is the NDI scan converter. So what that will look like is a little icon uh, in on your taskbar. It says NDI Scan Converter. And if you right click on it, it's going to give you a couple different options. Uh, it'll give you an option just to change your frame, uh, to set your frame rate. Uh, capture settings, which allows you to uh, basically, if you only wanted to have part of your screen um, recorded, you can go ahead and do that. And then you can also have the option to have your mouse pointer on uh, on the on the the video that goes across to the streaming PC. Um, and then your audio source in this case is going to be your broadcast stream mix. So it's going to be the same way you would set up a one PC setup. Uh, the NDI also gives you the option to send webcam video over as well. So as far as the GoXLR, um, you're going to just basically follow the one PC setup and then anything in your broadcast stream mix will get sent over NDI to the streaming PC. So in my case, I have my mic, uh, chat music, line in system and samples uh, going to the streaming PC. So let's go switch over to the streaming PC now and uh, we'll show you how to set that up. So now I'm over on the streaming PC. Um, what you're gonna do on the streaming PC uh, is install Streamlabs OBS and then you're also gonna install uh, the SDK package from NDI. So if you go to NDI, uh, there's the SDK package um, what that does is it allows Streamlabs, uh, it adds an option in Streamlabs to be able to receive an NDI source. Uh, so in this case, uh, all you would do is you would click on the plus option. Uh, you do click NDI source, and then you would add the source. Um, I'm actually going to show you that in just a second here. Um, so my gaming PCI, I notice it's over NDI. If I double click on that, it gives you a few different options. Uh, you can actually select which monitor from the gaming PC you want to pull in. Um, and then also it's going to pull in the audio from there as well. So we're just going to leave that as is. And in this case, uh, I have my gaming PC NDI. And if I um, turn off my streaming monitor, you'll see my gaming PC. This is the monitor for my gaming PC. If I move my mouse around, you can see it there. Um, and notice the audio is coming through as well. So the only other setup you have to do on the, the, the streaming PC is... Um, you're going to set your default audio to uh, just your, your, your regular speakers. And you're going to run a line from the speaker or line out on the streaming PC to the line in on the Go XLR. Uh, you're going to want to make, also make sure that you're using a ground, ground loop isolator on there so you don't get any buzzing noises. And that's about it. Uh, that's how to set up uh, Go XLR with Streamlabs OBS and NDI. 